What's up guys? So today we're gonna be talking about the Desert Product Spiral Wheel for Gold Collection. First thing you wanna do is get your good old fashioned angle meter. You wanna make sure it's set at 45 degrees on the wheel, which it is. Step two is you wanna make sure you have your tailings tray in. And step three, always make sure your catch cup is in there. Cause what happens and the way this thing works is since gold is 19 times heavier than anything else around it, all the other dirt, it actually sinks to the bottom and goes up these spiral wheels while the water washes all the rocks and sand away and only the gold makes it up to the cup. It's really, really interesting probably one of my favorite uh, tools we have. So we're gonna run just a little bit of dirt here and see how she does in collecting some gold. And we usually like to classify this down to about 20 mesh. I like to put it in as slow as possible, give it time to sink. Just remember guys, the words fast and gold do not go together. The slower you go, the more gold you're gonna find. So we'll let that run for, I don't know, let's say another minute or so. We'll see what we find. Oh yeah, well I didn't have to let it run that long. Nifty nifty. And I don't know if you can see this guys, but at the bottom of the cup, we've got gold since it's 19 times heavier than everything else around it. The gold just walks its way up. And that's how these spiral wheels work, guys. If you're wondering or if you're looking at getting one, I highly recommend it. It's great, no matter if you're a beginner or a professional. Um, we got the beginner version. But yeah, as you can see there, we got some nice color. Not bad. Well, guys, I hope you enjoyed this. Hope it was informative. And if you want to learn more, follow the channel. There'll be more to come. Thank you.